Good morning, my name is Wes Simpkins and I'm a product consultant for Live 365. They asked me to make a video a tutorial on making cue sheets. So I got with Dave Adams at KLYC Media, um, KLYC.us, and he uses some MG Kelly programming. So I got with Dave and I'm gonna make a cue sheet for you right here. Uh, and show you how to do it. So I already started with MG Kelly American Hit List. I put MG Kelly up here. I put American Hit List and I put the name of the audio file. The Q file has to match the audio file. These work very, very well in um, Station Playlist and Nextcast. And there are only two programs that I know of at this time that support Q sheets. Uh, you need these Q sheets so you can use syndicated programming to send the required metadata so you can get your sound exchange reporting done. So here's how we do it. This is all three programs. I already did segment one. So let's do segment two. I go in here, I copy it. Control C. I go over to my Q sheet. I go in here, I paste it, Control V. Now I need to take this out because that's just trash. That's just uh, MG Kelly saying that in yeah, American Hit List, we can put a little ID in there. So here we have um, artist space dash space title. All right, you're gonna do that for each uh, one of the songs that's in the segment, okay? Like I said, this is segment two. Now we're gonna use another free program. It's called Audacity. You can search that on Google. You open Audacity, you go in, you tell it to import audio. We're gonna import hour one, segment two. Now, while that's importing, we already know that our first song is gonna be by the Easy Beats and it's gonna be Friday on my mind. So that should be right here. That is this song right here, okay. <clears throat> And what we're going to do is we're going to find the end of this song. Right there. Look at there. There was our first first label. Control B as in boy. That marks a label right there for that song. Second song, we're going to find the end of it. It should be right here. And it was. So now we just use our left mouse button and we slide over to select. That's the next song. Control B as in boy, we put a label in there. And this should be the end of the song right here. Because I know we go. They do two minutes of commercials. So, we know their commercial spot starts here. We'll go back, line up to that other marker. Control B as in boy. Then go to the end. And that's their two minutes worth of commercials. Control B. Now we go to edit, labels, edit labels. How about that? And here's our times. We can export that now. Since we know it's segment two, let's save it as such. I can go in here. I can get rid of all that. Minimize. Go to the folder. Label track two. Here's our timings. Control C. Exit. Minimize. Control P. All right. So 
we always know on these segments that there's two minutes commercial. So we just put a little thing on here so we can mark it. We put KLYC space dash space. We'll be right back just so it comes over people's players in a digital stream. Very, very simple. Our file name is our one segment two. So we're going to save a cue sheet and it's going to save it as our one segment two dot C-U-E. Go in here. We save it into our playlist folder, and boom, we've created a cue sheet. Thanks for listening. If you have any questions, you can always hit us up. Support at live365.com. Thanks.